Hey guys, it's Roscoe, and on the Spence Couch today, I popped into Forbidden Planet in Croydon at lunchtime. They had some new stock in, and they had a bit of a sale. So, my bag of goodies, let's see what I have. First of all, is this. Who is it? It's Clone Commander Wolf the Black Series. It was nine, uh, 5 99 reduced from 11 99 So I haven't seen this variant previously. I can't remember if Wolf is the one missing an eye or if it's the other one who isn't Rex uh, from the Clones and Rebels. <laughs> there we see the back. I do like that this is... What is that? It's um, It almost looks like a Death Trooper or a TIE pilot, but it's clearly some form of Stormtrooper. What does it say on the back? This premiere collection of action figures is designed with exquisite detail and articulation. We shall find that out when we have our unboxing. But yes, very nice detailing. And the helmet is a different variant from what I have seen previously. So yes, very happy with that. Next, the Phantom from Rebels. This was actually was two ninety nine when it was rung up at the till, which is a great bargain. Uh, from was it nine ninety nine originally? Yes, and the others that I've got as well, they're also two ninety nine. So there we see the back. Yeah, some of the other ones. Uh, they actually had this and this, 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 and this all in stock. They didn't have that because obviously I would have gotten the ATST if they had it, and I was very tempted by the rate on her speeder bike because I've been looking for one of those for ages. But yes, very happy to have the Phantom. Next, also from Rebels, we have an A-Wing. I assume this is Hera's A-Wing from Phoenix Squadron. Now we see on the back here, the other ships. They did have that one in and the Falcon. They didn't have the U-Wing. They did have several X-Wings, particularly the Partisan one. They didn't have the Corellian Corvette, which I already have, of course. But yes, very nice detailing on this. Love the colour scheme on there with the green and the yellow highlights. Very, very nice. And then finally for now, from Rogue One, an AT-ACT, which I'm very happy with. And we shall have to compare this to the standard AT-80 in due course. Such a shame they didn't have the ATST. would have been great to have all of them. But they might get it in again at some point. So yes, uh, what is that one at the bottom? Oh, that's the tank. The hover tank <laughs> that had wheels and treads on it. But yes, you see the other standard ones there. And again, we see that. So yes, very happy with this. This has got a standal. It's got four legs. So maybe it's a bit wobbly. Who knows? But yes, that's what I picked up from Forbidden Planet Safe. It was about £14 or like thirteen ninety eight, that sort of thing, which is a fantastic bargain because that would have cost about 40 odd quid at full price and none of them are worth that at full price. They did have in the Black Series of that range um, other troopers as well, Commander Doom. There's one that kind of looked like a sand trooper but the helmet and the colouring on it was different. There was also was a Wookiee that I didn't recognise, but it looked a bit odd. Maybe it's like a Clone Wars Wookiee. I'm not sure. And several other things. They had um, Princess Leia as Boosh as well, which I did think about getting. I wasn't that keen on the head and facial sculpt, so I'll have to think about that one. Maybe I shall get that in due course. But for now, that was just what I picked up today from Forbidden Planet. Please subscribe to my channel if you enjoyed this content. Leave me a comment suggestion what comment topic you'd like to see discussed. Or like the video.